psalm 107 i'll be here very briefly just to charge our hearts along the theme psalm 107 from verse 8 and 9 please turn your bible if you have one you should have one psalm 107 verse 8 and 9 here's what it says oh that men would praise the lord for his goodness and for his wonderful works to the children of men verse 9 says for he satisfied the longing soul and filleth the hungry with goodness hallelujah one of the secrets of a life of continued advancement a life of continued progress as revealed from scripture is this this mystery that is called thanksgiving hallelujah the bible is full of men and women who were vocal about expressing their recognition of the mercy the hand and the grace of god upon their lives and the resultant effect of that discernment and that recognition the bible is also full of people who took god for granted and took his mercies for granted until they saw the other side of his mercy and they were left in shame they were left downcast and so the bible says the things that are written are for time it says they are for our learning so that we through the patience and the comfort of scripture might find hope that means that when we study these things they are a lesson for us so that we learn from history and then we'll be able to take advantage of the steps that were taken in time past and the results that followed hallelujah praise the name of the lord generally speaking gratitude and thanksgiving is predicated on three three things basically number one a recognition of help that is beyond the capacity of the recipient the foundation for thanksgiving is a recognition that you have obtained help from a source that is higher than you are we together now you do not need to give thanks if you are the one who is the doer nobody thanks himself you have to thank another influence that is other than you who was able to provide help that you could not provide so that is the first um, foundation for thanksgiving the recognition that this result this advancement this progress in my life even though it has happened it is the coordinated effort of many people and many systems outside of my influence in many regards if you do not realize that you are limited by yourself and that the results that you produce are not necessarily a true reflection of your ability they are a reflection of the mercy of god added to your ability so that recognition that i was assisted by a source higher and greater than me puts you in a position where you give thanks number two thanksgiving is also built on the understanding listen carefully thanksgiving is built on the understanding that the privilege that you enjoy it's not a privilege that everybody has for instance the privilege of life for instance the privilege of health when you understand and you recognize that some of these gifts and blessings that we trivialize like life like health like wisdom like advancement like a good family not everybody has had the privilege to enjoy that blessing it sponsors thanksgiving hallelujah by reason of what i do I have the opportunity to pray for people all the time and especially for people who are sick and downcast and sometimes I'm broken myself to see the kinds of situations that people go through are we together one time I remember praying for someone who had I think he had a fracture very major fracture and you know um, they attended to the legs but he told me that he had to hang that leg for three months 90 days except adjusted by the doctors so he would hang there and i said how do you sit in one place for 90 days now when you recognize that to walk 
is a blessing and a gift are we together the the gift of health the gift of longevity then it sponsors thanksgiving number three generally speaking thanksgiving is the key for more of anything the moment you celebrate god or you celebrate men and thank them sincerely for what they have done thanksgiving sustains the unique character of making um, the person who who gave the benevolence to do more are we together every time you celebrate people every time you acknowledge god for what he has done that thanksgiving sustains the ability to sponsor more of that result in your life that means if you find out that you you are experiencing certain levels of ups and then downs ups and then downs the answer could be that you are not apt to be grateful you find out that people enjoy certain levels of the lifting and the mercy of god and then for a very long time they don't seem to see the hand of god again it is because many times we are not careful and we are not intentional to acknowledge god are we blessed so